regret the path that I took and even the tough days and you know the days where I thought well when am I going to be back playing the sport again and um, you know the moment I experienced today was one of the most special in my career and I'm so happy that I'll, I'll have it for the rest of my life. You go through so much in a career you go through wins and you go through happy moments you go through tough losses and matches you should have won and, and you think oh when is when are things going to happen for me again? When am I going to get better? And you know, you get to this point where you achieve it again and you think that, you know, those days were so tough and it was so difficult, but everything is worth it because I think you, you learn so much from those days. You learn a lot from losing. You know, you learn it puts so much perspective in your eyes. You know, you're, you're eager to go back and get better. You know, I was number one a couple of times before my shoulder surgery and when I came back I didn't have much of a ranking and I, I thought to myself, well, I, I had this dream as a little girl to try to achieve, a, you know, the number one ranking and I really hope that I can do it again and, um, you know, I didn't know if I if I could get myself back at a professional level and, and playing week in, week out, um, you know, and beating top players, um, but to know that I'm back at number one is, um, is pretty incredible. I miss competing, you know, I miss being in those situations. I miss seeing my name in the draw of a tournament. It was, um, it was just something I really wanted to get back. There's no, no better feeling in the world than being in situations where you're, you know, five all in the third set and whether you're playing great or not great, it's only you and your opponent. It's about you trying to win that match and it's the most incredible feeling. I made a few adjustments after, um, you know, after my injury, and um, you know, I, I had a new coach. I, I changed rackets. Um, you know, I was testing out a few rackets, and uh, I, I picked up this one. And it was very different than what I had before. It was like I, I knew that I wanted to play with this racket, and no matter what it took, I really wanted to play, and I felt really good. And um, usually, when you're testing out rackets, it takes a few days to just get used to something. But from the first moment I hit a few balls, I was like, this, this feels extremely good, maybe too good. You know, sometimes it's like, you know, you play one day and you're like, this is amazing. Then the next day, you're like, oh, maybe it wasn't. But I, every day that I, I kept playing, and um, you put, try to put yourself in a match situation, also play some points, and, and I felt like, you know, when I was on the defense, it helped me a lot. Um, you know, I felt like I had more pace on my ball. Um, so those little things, you know, I, I really enjoyed. Well, next goal, I, I just want to enjoy this victory for the next few days. And, um, and when I step on the grass again, it's back to work. And, you know, I, I love the transition from clay to grass. I love, um, you know, practicing before Wimbledon when everything is quiet, just improving your game. And, um, but first, I need a little rest. <laughs> that's, that's on my mind right now.